Hey, howdy y'all. It is Wednesday, June 7th. That means bottle 7. Another 25 days of whiskey. Oh, hump day. Hope everybody's week's going all right. We're just going to, uh, we're, gonna, we're just going to jump into this, y'all. Well, that's a odd smell. It's a uh, very smoky. Yeah, almost. Hmm. Almost uh, campfire-ish, but not, not in a good way. Yeah. Not sure what to think about the nose on that. But, uh, hey, everybody's got a different nose, right? Just odd. Yeah, I don't, I don't get it, y'all. Ah, yeah. Uh, let's taste it. Charge, y'all. You definitely taste the smoke. There's a lot of spice. About the middle of my tongue is just burning. Um, not really picking up any outstanding flavors on it. It's just a lot of... There was a lot of pepper, a lot of heat. And just, just a burning sensation on the middle of my tongue. Then it just kind of flattens out. Not much really there for me on this one. Um, yeah, I don't know. Maybe if uh, I poured it and let it sit out for a few minutes or tried it with a few drops of water, maybe. Um, but yeah, just... Neat like that right after pouring it. Not favorable. <laughs> so, bottle seven, y'all. Balcones. Balcones. I don't know how to say it. Uh, brimstone. <laughs> Bottled at 106 proof, made with roasted blue corn. Uh, undisclosed mash bill. Other than the roasted blue corn, really don't know. I... It says pot distilled Texas scrub oak smoked. Original Texas whiskey. So this is it's not bourbon. It doesn't have to be 51% corn. Um, I don't know about this, y'all. On the back, it says non-chill filtered as always. But uh, aged at least one day in oak. All right. If anybody's down there and knows what the heck is going on with this aged one day in oak, um, what the heck are y'all doing down there? Aged one day in oak. Oh, Lordy. I don't know. Um, I, I know there's people out there that have, I've heard talk about this that like it. It's not entirely bad, and it might grow on you after a few drinks. But, you know, anything will grow on you after a few drinks. Not necessarily in order. Uh, but aged at least one day. Now the balcon the balcony's blue or however you pronounce that I don't know. I don't know. Um, it says on the back aged at least six months. So I know they claim that down in Texas because of the extreme heat that 
whiskey ages faster down there, but one day, I, I don't know, y'all. It's kind of reeking of Cleveland to me. If y'all know, then you know. <laughs> uh, yeah. Anyway, bottle seven, probably, probably not one for me. I'm probably not going to hunt this out. Um, I may not try it again unless somebody really talks me into it. Uh, but yeah, so far not a fan. I, I would probably try it one more time just to see if opening it up or adding a couple drops of water helps it out. But it's pretty flat after that, that heat hits and just not getting much out of it. It doesn't seem enjoyable drinking to me, but I know. Let me know what you guys think on the nose, on the palate. And yeah, not for me. Bottle seven, y'all. Brimstone 106 proof made from roasted blue corn. Aged at least one day. They're kicking it up down there, y'all. All right. See you guys back tomorrow for bottle eight on the 25 days. Uh, have a great night and stay safe out there. Bourbon on, y'all.